Hey, Hope City Church, it's Chandon here, your worship creative pastor, and it is day two of 10 days of prayer and faith, and I'm excited to share a little bit with you this morning. So if you've been to our church, you've, uh, you've walked into our lobby right here through these doors, and if you look to your right, you'll notice uh, some words on the wall. Those aren't just some fancy words and a cool painting. It's, it's what we believe. It's our, our core belief as a church that we have a mission and that is a relentless dedication to share the hope of Jesus with our city and beyond. Okay, well, how do we do that? It's broken down in four ways, four action steps. Our strategy to know God, to experience community, to make disciples, and to change the world. So what does that mean? How do we actually take that into a tangible form and, and do that? How do we share Jesus with people in simple ways? Well, ironically, it makes me think of a movie that Mel Gibson starred in called The Patriot. If you've ever watched The Patriot, there's a scene in there where he's teaching his son to shoot a rifle. And what he says to him to keep him from being overwhelmed at the target that they're practicing on, he says, aim small, hit small. And what that means to me and how I apply that to, to my faith is that when you hear the word in our mission statement, like to share the hope of Jesus with our city and beyond, those are really big terms. Like how can I, one person, share the hope of Jesus with our city? Well, God can use you to change the world if you truly believe it. And to do that, we take that and we aim small. So how do you do that? Okay, how do we share Jesus with our coworker, with a, a staff member, with a, a family member, with our child, with a teacher? Take that, that word city and break it down into practical steps of how you can share Jesus with people you encounter every single day, which will lead to beyond, which will lead to changing the world. Because you know, when God uses you to take radical steps of obedience, Things happen. Things change. People are saved. Destinies are changed forever. And so I want to encourage you today as you pray to be the light to our city and beyond, to be the light to the people you rub shoulders with, that pastors or leaders or staff of this church never gets around. But you are. You're equipped with the ministry of the gospel to share Jesus with those people. So as you pray, pray for the city of Bonita Springs, Estero, Fort Myers, Naples, and beyond. God wants to use you to change the world. So we're excited to see you at Church Sunday and excited to see you continue on to day three tomorrow of our 10 days of prayer and faith. It's been great to be with you. We'll see you next time.